I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> it's, it's happening again. It's happening again. How's everybody doing anyway? Are we doing well? Finally got there in the end. I'll tell you what it was. It's my stream deck. Because I've got multiple profiles for different uh, platforms like PlayStation, uh, Xbox, PC. Somehow it decided to go back to the Xbox One. So that's why your ears actually got destroyed then, Slendy. I'm so sorry. But as you currently see, we're in the burn round at the moment. We're just missing one member of the RU team. And then we will be going over to Domination. And we're looking at Lofton Islands Province, Amarita. <laughs> yeah, I feel a little more safe now, I know, right? How's it going, Noob Stalker? What's going on with TMG? So, Rogue Admins. Unfortunately, when they left the server, ended up killing the server off. It's slowly but surely getting rebuilt, my dude. So, it will be back. Obviously, the bots need to be implemented yet again. Uh, new admin. <coughs> Excuse me, new admin staff selected. And basically, just get back, get back on track, really. Just get back on track, my dude. Oh, and Slendy. Look, you're, you're playing Battlefield, but you're offline, but you're online, my dude. You're going to make up your mind. I'm joking, it's a glitch. <laughs> but it just has, has to be you, doesn't it, Slendy, mate? It just has to be you. <laughs> yeah, it's Origin Slendy, man. He was doing it all day yesterday as well. Doing it all day yesterday. I'm going to wish the guys good luck quickly in the chat. How's it going, Chunky Chap? How you doing, bro? Oh, you do. You don't want to know what happened just a second ago, my dude. Um, It was a little bit scuff. It's done it again. My, um... My stream deck has gone back to the default instead of being on um, the correct one. So I'm going to have to try and sort that out. So while we wait... You guys can have a look at the rosters. I need to just sort out the overlay slightly there because it is slightly overlapping. Hey, how's it going, buddy? Yeah, I'm doing well, mate. I'm doing well. I'm looking all the time up to 26k channel points. Holy hell. Are you going for that VIP? I see you out there, mate. You're going for that VIP. I know what you're doing. I know what you're doing. I will get the sword, guys. Now's the time to try and sort it out more than any. There we go. Let's see if that's better for me now. It's still no different. It's because I play at a different resolution on PC. So the screen capture is kind of compensating for that. Leaving my overlay at a little bit of a disadvantage. That's just gonna have to do for now. That's gonna have to do, right. Get there eventually, get there eventually. done it again right I'll try and sort that out after this cast I'll try and not use my stream deck as much because I'll end up actually switching scenes by the looks of things Anyway, how is everybody doing today? Hope you're doing well. Hope you're doing well. Welcome, welcome, welcome. We're going to be looking at TWP going up at, against RU, which are RU team for sure. 
and they're going to be doing a domination over three maps. So we're currently looking at the burn round of El Marge. That will quickly change to Lofton Islands province and followed by Marita. We're still waiting for one more member of the RU team to join in before we crack on with it. Hungover. Oh god, how much did you do, dude? How much did you do? Gmayo, hello, hello. How are you doing? How are you doing? Hope you're doing well, mate. Hope you're doing well. Who are these teams? Hey, how's it going, Catfish? This is PC, my dude. This is PC. Watch Catfish, right? You know the, you know the infinite firing gun glitch? It doesn't exist on PC. It doesn't exist. Oh, yeah, man. You'd be mixing your drinks. If you mix your drinks, you get absolutely destroyed the following day. So like you come in, you're having, I don't know, a cider, and then you'll go over to a shot of something, and then you'll go to a beer, and then that's it. You just, poof. I cast my platform. Yeah, I cast all platforms, Catfish. PlayStation, Xbox, and PC. Okay, so we're going to pause that music quickly. We are on Lofton Islands. First of all, I believe I'm going to increase my FOV for casting. There we go. That's a lot better. Oof. Yeah, man. Yeah, definitely mix new drinks is a bad idea. Proper bad idea. Okay, so this is not your standard Lofton Islands. We are on domination instead of score conquest. 16 versus 16. Again, we're still missing one member of the RU team. I'm sure he's going to be around very, very shortly. And here we go. So you currently see the flags in a total different position. So you've got Alpha over there on the red building, where you'd normally see Alpha on the yellow building there at the center of the objective. Going over towards Bravo is actually at the center point now next to the silos instead of being on the docking area. Going over to Charlie, which is actually at the spawn point for the Germans in Skull Conquest. So it's very different layout indeed. And you currently see a lot of gunfights going off. TWP coming in, lighting up that leaderboard. Jettison getting in a double headshot with that sniper rifle he's got. Let's go and have a look at Mizuki. He's going to be putting down some fire with that STG-44. But unfortunately getting dropped there by a member of our U team. Let's keep an eye on Commandant. Who is going to be coming in with a few shots over the FG42. Trying to get himself a kill. Not able to pick it up. However, he starts to move over towards Bravo. To try and stop these guys from coming in. Does take down Watkins. He's now going to be looking for Ready Player J. With Anholio coming up the top as well. No in-game audio. Why isn't that not working? It's that day again today, mate. I've got it. I know the issue. Uh, that needs to output to... Have we got it? I think we've got it. Cool. Right, yeah, so we're back in. I've got the audio fixed there. A few little sounds were mishaps in this place, but we are back in. I can see the game the sound actually working now as well. So, back to it, we have got TWP coming in with the lead at the moment, 154 ticks from 121. We've got a lot of gunfights going down at the Red Bull and the area, we've just got white over there, it's currently down at the moment, that's all here, you guys, what you expect, they're trying to get some rounds over the edge of the carbine, trying to get himself a cheap kill.
You're not going to see the game for a second. That's fine on that area. It's just down to my stream rig. Yo, Archie, for the 50 bits. Thank you, my dude. I appreciate it. Bear with me just a few seconds while I try and get this sorted out. Yeah, it's doing good, man. Unfortunately, I'm having real big issues with the sound at the moment. I might see if I can forward it over to another... Um... It's typical, man. It's just my day again, isn't it? Right, bear me just two seconds. I need to check my IP addresses. I'm so sorry about this, guys. Oh my god, what's happening to that body? Let me know, guys, if... Very nice. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Right, I'm going to forward it over. I'm just going to have to forward it over to my desktop audio. Give me two seconds while I do that. Yeah, it's, it's not... It's, it's, it never happens to me, though, normally. It's just it happens to happen at the most opportune moments oh, possible. Yo, yeah. thank you for the follow, my dude. I appreciate it. Just going to iron out this bug. See, I can. I got the audio coming through. Got it. But it's not showing up on my on my stream rig. We have 
Right, are we good? Are we good? There's no echoing? Are we good? I hope so. We're not good, are we? I can see it echoing. Yeah, it's echoing. Why? Right, are we good? My god, that was a pain in the ass. Thank god. Oh my god. I am so sorry about that, guys. I am so sorry. I don't know what happened. My, my voice meter was just not behaving. I had to switch total audio source to a different virtual cable for it to just get working properly about the echo. So freaking weird. So freaking weird. Right. I'm going to leave the settings alone now. I'm not even going to touch them again. That was insane. I'm just going to get back into the game. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Right. Back into it. You can currently see some flares going off there. We got Ready Player J with Mary Chain now looking to move through, going over towards Bravo. By the looks of things, DW DWP is not in the lead. We have got 100 ticket lead coming in from are you team i am pro now looking to move in putting down some fire over towards alpha the m2 carbine coming in with a panzerfaust looking to reload that big boy rocket of his he's gonna be looking to put down some rounds of range straight into the bravo objective but I believe his team is in full control here you can see the medics are starting to move up a big explosion going off right next to the silos as they attempt to take him down I'll just make sure i wasn't muted then <laughs> and by the looks of things as well we've got the grilled potato on Bravo at the moment for DWP in control. Two out of three of the objectives with that M2 carbine just looking to keep around the objectives at the moment. And just looking to keep everything at bay. Looking over towards Alpha, we've got TWP, Ready Player J, Missouri along 
with Watkins and Harpy, who's going to be making their ways from underneath the docking where you would normally see the Bravo object and make their way up towards that Charlie point as they attempt to keep RU team at bay. Now, RU team is currently in the lead still. Tickets are counting down. Let's who comes out ahead here. So Bravo slowly being captured back by RU team at the moment. They're now looking to push straight through TWP. I need healing coming in with a cheeky kill there. Knocking him straight over the fencing. Putting down some fire there. You need healing. Going to be going up against him. Taking a lovely kill on a Cosmos. Taking him down at point blank range. That's Stumke there. 1-5. Unfortunately getting sprayed from the door from Pro. But Pro getting picked up by Watkins from behind. With that M1907 sweeper. Door being shut there. Looking at Cosmos now moving to that left side. The building getting absolutely decimated. As they now move over towards the Alpha Point. Oh, yeah. Okay, no, I can't hear that myself, but that's fine. I'll sort that out again. Okay, so Ready Player J here with Harpy. Currently on the rocket at the beach sector. Looking to move up again towards Bravo. Hopefully they can get hold of this objective. Because if they do, they're able to try and pull this back. They're looking at 42 tickets to 90 at the moment. We have got a few members here. You need healing with that Stumgewehr. Looking to put down some rounds of range. Trying to get himself a cheeky kill. Gets a little head. 126 damage. Not being able to pick up a kill. However, I am pro. Getting taken down Demios Phobos. Looking at KDV who just went down as well. We have got Harpy inside. Mizuki and Ready Player J just attempting to leave this yellow house. But they're constantly being gunned down by RU team. We're going to be looking at Narcs here. He's going to be putting down some 80 grenade pistol rounds straight into that building. Looking to pick up a kill or two. Takes some fire from behind. He will be going down to the M2 Carbine of Missouri, who's going to be moving over towards that Charlie objective to try and get that back cap onto the RU team as they currently take hold of Bravo once again. So we are looking at 87 to 33. The tickets are still going down for TWP. They do hold two out of three of the objectives. And we have got Mizuchi making his way straight into that Charlie point. However, taking some fire from over the cross of silos. We've got a lot of our U team just making a pushback at the moment. As they will be coming in to try and take everybody out. Big explosions going off in the middle there. Lots of kill feed going off for the blue side of DWP. Looking like Merry Chain here. As an assault player, we'll be looking to put down some rounds with that Give Let's see what she's able to do. Oh, it's not Stum Gewehr. I, mean, I apologize. An M2 carbine. And unfortunately, will be dropped there by an evil Spectre. Who's using that glorious Swomi with the big boy mag. As he looks to move all the way over towards that Alpha objective. Coming in with a few rounds of range. Trying to pick up a kill. Finds that someone actually underneath the dock in there. Taking down handsome hands. Taking a few shots there from a sniper. In a lot of trouble by the looks of things. Who is that? Oh, you're not fooling me at that one, my dude. Comes in with a firecracker. Looking to try and fool me out of that objective. Using Iron Sighted. Is that a Risker 99? Not quite sure what that is, actually. Gravere uh, uh, 95, sorry. M95 is using in Iron Sighted style. No scopes needed whatsoever. He's putting down some of that Iron Sight punishment. Over towards Komandan, who went down straight away. Looks like we will see our U team making a big push against TWP to try and keep him off of the Bravo objective as they try to take the lead here and take the full scoreboard. KDV along with Cosmos, Spectre, Cord, Elisa. We've just seen a big kill coming in from an MMG of God of War. Now where is God of War here? He's starting to pull back. He's using that big boy MMG. Looks like we're looking at Lou now, who's coming in for the revive. Picking his teammates up, doing the job, just making sure everyone is back into the game. Look at that, getting those stabs in, and just making sure everyone's ready to rock and roll once again. Let's have a look here at the loads of the guys at the bottom of the beach sector. Watkins making his way towards the right side underneath the docking, making the way all the way around the outside with the M1911 sweeper. He's going to be running to a member here of RU team, puts down some fire, not managing to finish him off, and he's taking some return fire there. Let's take a look at Antoa, who will be going down to Watkins. In a fashionable style. So we are down to 17 tickets remaining for TWP to RU Team's 67. RU Team is coming in with a nicely lovely double kill coming in from Audrey. Sorry, from Mizuki, not Audrey. Taking down 
two of those members with that lovely Tommy Gun looking to push up towards the silos again. Takes a fire from that left flank, comes in with a few hit fire range hits, but unfortunately will be taken out by KDV as Ready Player J will be looking to push through as well. Coming in with a kill against him. And now looking to move up towards Bravos. Bravos under TWP control. Coming in with the M2 Carbine. Trying to get down some shots. Lovely Dice Friend emblem there as well. Coming in with a few shots. Take down Audrey. Getting that reload off. Coming in. Taking down Negress as well. Just holding there. Getting some health back from his teammates as they now try to push back into Bravo. Who's currently being taken by the RU team. We've got I Am Cord trying to make his way there. As he's going past the sandbag wall, putting down some fire with the FG-42 to the top of that scout tower. Watkins, however, does take him down. We're down just 15 tickets for TWP. Another flare going out there by Simsay, who is going to be coming in with that iron-sighted M95 Gewehr as he's trying to get some cheeky headshots there and get a nice little feed. So we're down to just 12 tickets. What I'm going to be doing is starting to look at these leaderboards because we're going to see who's come out with the biggest kills going on this game so far so we've got 44 and 19 to parkway b mary chain with a 35 and 15 28 and 16 to a grilled potato you need healing with a 41 and 10 well done my dude indeed 18 and 1 to god of war again well done for an mmg player as well keeping that at one death pretty damn good pretty damn good looks like both teams are actually fully present now 35 and 16 to evil specter and nix with the 28 and 11 23 and 12 to commandant parkway is a beast Parkway is a beast. He's a medic as well. Here he is himself going in. Trying to get hold of Grilled Potato. What are you using? Are you using a grease gun? He is using a grease gun. He just went down there, unfortunately. But he's going ahead with the grease gun on this map. We're down to just seven tickets remaining. 250 in lead to the RU team at the moment. We've still got two maps to go. I'm glad I managed to sort out the sound issue in the very first map. And didn't realize it actually happened uh, a little bit later on. And I'm going to get fooled by this, aren't I? Oh, no, we don't. It's actually someone there. Who we got here? So we got Rust using. Is that? Oh my god! Okay, we know what he's using. I don't need. I don't need to say it. Coming in, taking down Grill Petit Potato at the very end. Fifty ticket win for the RU team. GG's to both teams are very well played indeed. Let's have a look at those leaderboards. If my controller will actually work, there you go. Right at the very end, your top team will be going to Evil Spectre, Shadow Death, BLR, and Nurkis. Let's update that on the scoreboard. 50 tickets lead there for the Russian RU team, I believe. Boom. And now we're going to be loading over to the next map, which will be Province. It will be Province. How's it going, Washed? What in the world is this? This is PC, my dude. This is PC. Right, let's get that music back on. I need to be able to hear it, so I need to be able to output this to myself. I've done it. I've sorted it. Thank God for that. I'm not going to touch it again. Okay, so domination. Okay, so this is not going to be your typical province. We are looking at... Okay, so teams haven't yet started, but I'll carry on saying what I was going to say. So we're looking at the province. I think it's a team deathmatch province, right? Instead of the um, the squad conquest province. Because the squad conquest province would take place here. This would be the map. But we have moved over towards the right-hand side of the map. Where well, you've got the big tree in the middle for domination. Charlie Point being the church. You've got Bravo here right next to the bridge. And then over towards Alpha. Where it's at the very, very back. Next to what I like to call the restaurant's outside part. With like the parasols and the chairs. But I'm just, I normally just call it blue car. So here we go. So we're going to see them start going into it very, very shortly. I think they're just having a quick toilet break. One member of our RU team is missing again. Let's get that music back on while we wait. I'm just glad that I've managed to fix that audio issue. 
Oh, for God's sake, I was going to have a drink then as well. They've started. Right. <laughs> Never mind. Back to it. So, we're going to see pushing in, coming in from TWP as they take it down the bottom area. Bravo being claimed instantly by our U team. Evil Spectre going up against Watkins, coming in with another few shots there. Going up against someone with an MMG, taking out God of War with that Sawomi. Coming in with that lovely, lovely, lovely kill. Taking down Harm Pie as well. Coming through, getting a cheeky feed there. Slendy, will you stop coming online, my dude? Will you stop? I'm joking, mate. I'm joking. Okay, so this building absolutely getting decimated here. Looks like the RU team will be in held of the full Bravo objective as they've cleared out majority of this. Alpha Point, however, being taken back by TWP's Mizuchi, who's gone on to the objective. <laughs> And Charlie Point being taken by TWP as well. So they've got a cheeky, cheeky pinch on the RU guys. But they are managing to push back in towards Alpha. And also will actually be moving back in towards Charlie. If they can take down Uni's healing. Who's coming in with a pistol and will be taken down there by BLR. Dude, I'm literally not doing anything. <laughs> but you are. You're trolling me, President Slendy. You're trolling me, my dude. You're trolling me. Okay, so looking at TWP guys at the moment, moving up their way past Bravo. Alpha Point fully, fully neutralized. It looks like TWP will be all over that objective to reclaim it back. Looking now over towards the RU team. Guys, let's have a look at Yifo, who's going to be moving in from the rear. Maybe able to pick up a few cheeky kills. Coming in with the ZK383, getting absolutely blasted there. And able to get picked back up and try it again. Let's see if he's able to get a few more kills. Coming in from behind, and unfortunately will get taken down again. Very unlucky indeed as TWP... We'll now start to lose hold of Bravo as Iron Pros are launching those pirate launchers into the smoke. Unfortunately, we've just seen them drop as well. We've got quite a few members here. TWP all down on that house. We've got a few guys up here. We've got I Need Healing with the FG42. I keep calling them I Need Healing. That's a uh, Overwatch statement for you there. He's looking to move in as well. Going up against the RU team. Let's see if he's able to get a few kills here. Comes in with a few rounds with the FG42. Getting dropped instantly. By a Nurkis with that bar rifle. So looking around, actually a bar rifle with the AA sight, something you don't see every day. Coming in with a few rounds there, but getting taken down. Getting taken down by the camp killer. And we're looking at Lou at the moment, who's starting to move through as well. Looking for a kill to moving straight over towards that Charlie point, hoping to get hold of this objective and claim a full triple cap against. Our youth team look for the members inside the building. Looks like the building is fully cleared. He's going to be looking to move out now to that left flank. Look for any more members currently around the objective. Has not seen on the left side who was there. But I believe his teammate actually took down Commandant anyway. Lou coming in with a cheeky kill. And unfortunately getting taken down by KDV with that grease gun. Who's going in for the revise. Picking the teammates back up. And looking to carry on. Jetson coming in with that iron sighted M95. No worries, Slendy. Enjoy yourself, my dude. Enjoy. Unfortunately, we'll be going down there as well as he gets taken down by Yifo. So we're looking at Bravo. Still under TWP control. Alpha slowly being reclaimed by their team. And they're now looking to push out and branch over towards the RU guys. But Evil Spectre and Iron Pro. Actually getting shot from behind. They're in a little bit of a pinch mode. I am Alicia. If you're going to be going in for that revive, picking the teammate back up and ready to rock and roll again. ZK383 in hand. Making their way over towards that Charlie slash Bravo object. Coming in with a few shots there. Taking down one. Almost getting the double kill when Mary Jane already goes down to Cosmos. Looking at. And Toha at the moment is out in the open. Getting killed off there by the sniper of Jetson. However, Commandant coming in for the revive, instantly picking up his teammate. Let's have a look at Deimos Phobos at the moment, is moving his way through. Coming in with that Tommy gun, getting some hip fire rounds straight through, getting stabbed from behind, losing those shinies and losing those tags. Okay, so looking down here towards Rustamka for the RU team. Going to be looking from the top of that staircase, putting down some rounds with that Sturmgewehr 1-5 with the three times. Going to be looking to try and get a kill here. Let's see what he's able to do. He's got his teammate spawning right next to him on the left side. Looking to move up. That is Cosmos. He's going to be going for the kill. And TWP member Mizuki does go down. 
But we've just seen the TWP member jump straight out of the house, which is Harmpai going for the revive. And he's going to be bailed a bit, packed up. Let's have a look and see at Mizuchi, who knows he's just been killed from this interior building. He's going to be looking for that member to kill off, but I believe some handsome hands took him down. Okay, so looking at the overall map at the moment, it's pretty damn close game indeed. Our U team is currently in the lead, but only by less than 10 tickets. Commandant making the way up there with the Evil Spectre. Evil Spectre looking to put down a few rounds over that Suwomi. Gets a cheeky reload off, still taking cover behind that wall. Coming in for a few shots there, but gets the assist counters kill against Mizuchi. And we did just see a RU push over towards the Alpha Point, but does get snuffed out by the defending members of TWP. A grill Potato is actually coming in for a very nice flank. Comes with one kill against Commandant, takes him out instantly. Now looking to move up this right side, trying to find any more members, but I believe the rest of his team's already done the work there. Now, Alpha is being claimed. We have got our U team all over that Alpha objective. They spawn back in. They've taken all this objective. I believe that is a uh, spawn beacon. It is indeed. And by the looks of things, they are putting down a lot of firepower onto that Bravo objective. Charlie being taken back by TWP as well. We got some gunfire coming from the top end with the FG42 of Narpol. Okay. Cat just walked in. Viam Pro there moving in along with Cosmos. Lou moving up the staircase here for TWP. He's going to be able to get a few kills here. Iron Pro not going to be looking for this, but gets the headshot with that M1907 sweeper just in the nick of time. As he starts to move over to his left side looking for the rest of those kills. Let's see what he's able to do. Okay, so gets out that pirate launcher, looking to get himself a kill. Looks like Bravo and Alpha are under RU team control at the moment. Charlie Point still under TWP control. And they're still looking to hold that for the majority of this game. Now, we do see Majuki on his way through. Probably butchering his name here. It's, it's Michichuki or something. Coming in with a few shots there. Take it down, Audrey. M1907 sweeper in hand. Looking to get another kill here. Let's see what he's able to do. Coming in with a few rounds of the M1911. M1911? That's not right. M1907. So we've got Kotzer Persik currently at the bottom here just waiting. I believe he took a bit of fire there. So he's constantly watching for the bottom area. Seeing if he's about to be pushed. Audrey as well as backup as a medic. Looks like Yifo just went down. They're going to be moving to the bottom river part. All the way up towards Charlie. Alright, over towards Bravo. Because Bravo is currently being captured here by TWP. Camp Kill and Watkins on the objective. Coming in with the Panzer Faust there, dealing a little bit of damage, but not picking up that kill. We have got Zelini getting a kill onto Yifo there with the Panzer Faust. Going down, unfortunately, was Watkins to Iron Pro with the M1907 Sweeper. Commandant coming in with a few cheeky shots there through the smoke with that FG42 going into prone. Keeping hold of that Bravo objective, looking around for any enemy members trying to reclaim this objective away from them. Which he is going about to run into one. He's about to find him. And he does indeed. He finds God of War there. Sat up prone. Ready to get some MMG fire out, and unfortunately will be going down instantly to the member. That's my cat, by the way. Okay, so looking over towards the Bravo object at the moment. At the moment, we've got Parkway that just went down on the Bravo objective. We've got Yifo looking to move in, going up against Lou, trying to take him down through the smoke, but utilizing that plant pulse cover. Big brain place, big brain place. And we have just seen Cosmos going down as he takes down Demos Thobos. Charlie Point is coming over under a lot of pressure from the TWP guys. They're looking to try and take the lead here, and they have managed just to grab that lead for themselves. So they're now going to be looking to push through, get hold of Charlie, but by doing this, because it's domination, the spawn points do flip. So instead of like score conquest base, where you will start to see teams um, getting spawn capped, you cannot do this on domination. So the good thing about that is our U team is now going back onto Alpha as they spawn from that direction as it's been flipped. Here comes Antoa, along with rest, uh, Rust. We've got KDV, and we've got Sime coming straight out for a few shots there. Getting hold of a cheeky double as he headshots. Antoa takes down Rust with a lovely kill there. one 907 sweeper. Unfortunately, get dropped there from behind to Naprolom. Here comes some handsome hands all the way over the Alpha objective. Looking to take this back using a three times FG42. 
coming in with a few rounds at range. Not able to pick up that kill, however. You need healing. Getting a nice little headshot kill onto Shadow Death. Real Potato take down Narpramano. And unfortunately, we just seen some handsome hands go down to RU team as they start to take back that Alpha objective. Simsei on his way through as well. Let's see what he's able to do. Goes for the grenade. Pulls back behind that car. Takes the fire again and we'll be going down. I will be going down. We'll be taking down Cosmos as he starts to move up into the Alpha objective. Look for any more kills. He does not spot Mary Chain, who will come in and get that kill. Okay, so looking at Charlie at the moment, we've got Ready Player J along with God of War Parkway. All over that Charlie point looking to reclaim it for TWP. Iron Pro is going to be coming in from the top side. Just getting a spawn off for his teammate, Manjin to pull back slightly. Now I believe his teammate will be dropped here, so he's got to be super damn careful. Manjin to pull left, make his way over towards the archway to try and see if there's any member pushing him. And it was Harmpai who just went down to Iron Pro. He's now rooted, rotated back to come in with a lovely double kill as he takes down You Needs Healing. And Ready Player J. And unfortunately will then go down to the MMG of God of War. And then our God of War gets traded off there with Yifo with the ZK383. Still in control, Charlie. Very well done to the RU guys for that big, big play. Simsei looking to move up now. Unfortunately getting shot down as well. Shadow Death going down. We have got movement going back from some handsome hands with that FG42. Let's see if he's able to get a few more kills over that three times of this. Okay, so Handsome Hands takes refuge into the building. We've got a lot of RU guys coming in with Spectre being the first one. Trying to put down a few rounds without Swemi. Oh, to jump in. But by doing so, he gets grilled. Literally gets grilled by Potato. And then gets goes for the revive onto his teammate. And able to push out from that left side. Goes for another kill onto Commandant. Parkway coming in with a cheeky assist there. Almost picking up a secondary kill. But unfortunately getting killed off himself. By that long range weapon from Cosmos. Cosmos, unfortunately, getting killed off there by TWP. Jettison with that sniper rifle, the M95 Gewehr with the iron sights. Going to be looking to put out some rounds. Let's see if he's able to carry this on. So he's looking over towards Charlie, looking back towards Bravo just to make sure there's no one around his position. So Charlie's the only point being covered here by our U team at the moment. But we are starting to see some spawnings occurring. And we have got Napro at the moment inside the objective. He's going to be able to sit on there without any sign of contestion. Looking over towards that Charlie point, we have got Rust, who is currently down on top of the church. Spectre moving out along with Persic. Grill Potato looking to move through. Let's see what Grill Potato can do. As he's holding there with that Sawomi. Comes in with a few shots, but gets pinched by the members of the RU team of Spectre. With the help of Shadow Death and BLR. But we've got incoming TWP on all fronts. Lou trying to go out in the open there. But unfortunately getting sprayed down by Yifo. Looking down towards Handsome Hands at the moment. He's going to be trying to climb up that wall. And I don't believe he's going to be able to achieve this. Oh dear. Not going to be able to achieve my dude. So he's deciding to go down to the bottom river. And cross through the archway. Up until he hits up towards Charlie. So he's going to be going through towards Bravo. Looks like he's going to try and get out some rounds here with that lovely 3x FG. Managing to pick up the assist there on a few of those kills. He's going to come in for a bit more, sh a few more rounds there at long range. But he's not going to be able to get a kill or two because they're going to be able to take cover very, very quickly. And you currently see RU team. We did just see one go down as Handsome Hands picks up uh, uh, Persic. Starts to move through as well. Now looking for another kill. Is he going to be able to do it? Or are they going to be able to come in straight to Bravo and reclaim it? And by the looks of it, just as quick as that TWP takes back Bravo for their team. I am pro going down top of the building. We've got Ready Player J coming in. Along with all of his teammates at TWP of Anhio going down. Yifo going straight through the smoke. All the balls, but unfortunately will be dropped there by Lou. Real Potato coming in for the revive onto the teammate. Picking them back up and getting them back into the fight. Looking now over to I am pro who's going to be going up against Evil... Well, not Evil Spectre. Going up with Simsei, but Simsei comes in with the kill against Shadow. And will go down himself. Oh my god, Jetson right behind Alyssa misses with the point blank shot. Comes in for the melee, taking him down with the shovel. Taking those shinies for me and grabbing those tags. And unfortunately will be dropped from behind to I am cord with this work. 
coming in with a few more rounds of range. Looking to pick up a kill or two. Bravo point is about to be claimed back here by TWP. TWP out on top. Are they going to be able to contain this? Are they going to be able to come ahead here with the lead in ticket form as they're going? Are they starting to win the map of province away from the RU team, guys? But this could flip at any time. Okay, so looking at Grilled Potato at the moment, making a big push past all of these RU bodies. Going up against Atoa, taking them down. Grilled Potato coming in for the secondary kill. Let's see if he's able to do it here with this Swomi of his. Coming in with a few shots, takes down KDB as well. Runs into another member, almost takes him down, but unfortunately will be going down to the right side as Yifo picks him off before going down himself. Two, if anything, you need healing with an infrared M3 rifle. Cam killer just waiting. Listening out for any sort of movements coming in from any of the enemy team. So he's going to be looking to pop out a few grenades there over towards where I am called. And Evil Spectre just died. I am pro coming in as well with Alyssa. And Yifo looking to put down a few rounds. He'll be able to push here. Let's have a look at Alyssa here. In pro in the moment. Takes down Parkway. Goes for the secondary one. But will be killed off by Lou pretty damn quick. Okay, so Parkway making his way up the top end here. Could be trying to jump this wall. Yep, getting on his way over towards that Alpha objective to try and take it back away from the RU team. Let's see if Parkway's able to follow up with a double kill. He does indeed. He takes down Antoa and Rust. And he's going to be looking to move through and get himself a triple as he comes in. Gets hold of one, but unfortunately gets dropped by Yifo before Yifo goes down to Ready Player J. But I believe with the smoke being deployed on this objective, I am caught as the last man standing there for the RU team. And we're going to start seeing Ready Player J start to move up very slowly as they try to take back Alpha away from RU. So we're looking at 34 tickets, 280 at the moment in lead to TWP. TWP coming in with a massive lead. Let's have a look and see what else is going down here. So a few shots going down from the RU guys. They're making a push down to the riverbed. And try and make their way over towards either Bravo or Charlie. And they're going to be running to red members like Ready Player J. Going through that smoke there. Hearing the movement but not seeing him. Coming in with a kill against Commandant with the M2 Garbine. Getting dropped however. Getting dropped however by Simsei. Here comes Camp Killer. Up at the top of the building at the moment. Looking to put down some rounds. Let's see what he's able to do with the M1907 Sweeper. So there's a lot of movement to his right. There's a bunch of RU guys. We've got a bunch of TWP on top of the bridge with Mary Chain and Lou. Now, if Mary Chain is going to be able to come in with a kill here, let's see. So Lou unfortunately goes down. Mary Chain goes down as well. I have no idea why it keeps doing that, but it does indeed. An RU team takes down Camp Killer, and they're going to be looking to push up towards that Charlie point and claim the back cap just in the nick of time, hopefully, to try and start flipping this game. I'm Elisa coming in. He's going to be looking to capture that objective. Just lost his teammate in front of him. Looking for it. And unfortunately will be going down to Mary Chain. Camp Killer going down as well. Mary Chain coming out into the open. Taking a few rounds in return. But unfortunately will not go down. Let's have a look at Persik. Who's down to 27 HP in a dream. He's going to be looking to try and keep hold of this. Coming in with a few rounds of the M1907 Sweeper. Trying to get himself a kill. Unfortunately, getting dropped instantly. His 10 tickets remain here for the RU team. Charlie Point getting claimed, however, by RU. Alpha still on RU control as well. They're going to come in with a double cap if Charlie is able to be captured here. But TWP is all over that. Let's have a look at Lisa. Lisa, unfortunately, going down there to a Parkway with the Tommy gun. Okay, so we're looking at eight tickets remaining. RU team managing to get hold of two of the objectives, bringing the tickets down very, very slowly. As you can currently see, they're now draining the tickets away from TWP. 78 to 8 at the moment. They've got some catching up to do. Comes in with a kill against Jettison, but Parkway takes him down instantly with that Tommy gun. Coming in with a few rounds as well. Opts in for the secondary, but unfortunately will be getting dropped there by Audrey as Audrey comes in for the revive and making sure the teammates will all back up and ready to rock and roll. So. TWP still all over the Alpha objective, managing to take back hold of that objective away from our U team. But KDV does have a spawn beacon in the back alley. And we've got Nurkis here on his way through. But unfortunately, we'll be going down to the sniper rifle with Jetson. Mizuchi coming in, getting hold of a kill into Persic. Very well done indeed. Ready player J on the way into Bravo as well with Mary Chain involved. And they're going to be looking to continue to hold this objective for the last few tickets remaining in this game. 
So let's have a look at these leaderboards to see who's come out on top. Uni's healing with a 39 and 13. Very well done indeed. 40 and 20 to Parkway. Well done. 23 and 14 to some handsome hands. Mazurchi with the 40 and 14. Very well indeed. Mary Chain with the 45 and 9. Very, very, very well. Over towards the RU team. We got 36 and 22 Spectre. We've got I Am Pro with the 41 and 14. 27 and 22 to Yifo Lisa with the 20 and 24. Commandant with 25 and 19. And the sixth player, which is Nurkis with a 23 and 16. We're down to just two tickets remaining. Bravo Point slowly getting taken back here from DWP. TWP. And if they manage to keep hold of this objective, they have come out on top. However, our U team coming back, taking all that Bravo objective, going for the revives. Finds himself a few members are coming in with a few shots. Take one down, but unfortunately will get dropped by the other. However, Demo, Demos Phobos comes in with a revive. And gets in with a kill. Here comes Iron Pro. Using an MMG. Get a headshot onto Missouri. Takes down Parkway as well. Finds another member. Almost gets the kill on that one. But unfortunately will not. Two tickets still remaining. Are you team taking back that secondary objective? We're still going to be seeing those tickets count down. But they need to be able to get these revives here. Because tickets. If they bleed out. I believe that's a GG's in domination. Okay, it doesn't count. It's not like Squad Conquest. So we will now see Bravo take it back by TWP. GG's to both teams. Very, very well played indeed. And very, very well done. Let's have a look at that scoreboard. Lovely indeed. 58 ticket win from TWP on the very second map. That pulls them ahead very, very slightly there. And they have one, one round each at the moment. Okay, so we're loading over to the last map today, which will be Marita. Okay, so we're over to Marita now. 20 seconds remaining. Let's check that both teams are still fully in the game. One of the RU guys is still missing at the moment, unfortunately. But he should be back any moment now. So, one win aside at the present time. TWP winning the last round on Province. Russian RU team coming in with the win on Lofton Island to start with. 50 tickets to 58 as well. So, TWP ahead by 8 tickets at the moment, but I don't believe that counts. And by the looks of things, we are going to be seeing the teams starting off straight away. GG's to both teams. Let's see who comes out top here in the final round of tonight's game on PC between TWP and RU. So straight away, you can see that Bravo's been taken by TWP along with Alpha. So they've got the majority instantly off the bat there. However, RU team coming in in full force. And by doing so, they've started to clear out the TWP forces. Two members are currently down. Watkins trying to go for the revive here. He may actually be going down to Narpo Romo. I believe that's what he's called. I'm just going to call him Narpo. And unfortunately, did take him down indeed. So they're going to be looking to take hold of Bravo Objective for the RU team. Incoming TWP members of Harm Pie, Ready Player J, Mizuchi. Along with Watkins, quite a few members here. Grilled Potato as well is going to be looking to come in with a few shots there. Losing his teammate to his right. A grenade going off from God of War taking down their Toa. And look at that movement coming straight in. We've got Shadow Death with a lovely double kill. And the revive coming in before going down and getting sprayed by Parkway. Alyssa though is back into the game but getting killed off instantly. Bravo still remains on the RU side. For how long? Ready player J currently inside that Bravo house looking to try and claim it back but getting absolutely sprayed there from behind. And I do see KDV rocking a trench carbine, something you don't see every day. I want to take a look and see what he's up to. So we are seeing that Alpha Point actually start to fall back to TWP control. It's just Spectre on his own. He does get spawned off there for BLR. But BLR just went down to the Suomi. So he's going to be waiting up top of that staircase. <clears throat> Unfortunately, will be going out there. 
and getting killed off by grilled potato. Okay, so he's just seen a flare going out there at the back end. There is KDV with that trench rifle going on top of the houses in Marita here. As he's going to be looking to push through and try and get a few cheeky kills. Let's see what he's able to do is he starts to move his way over to the top end. Takes some fire and unfortunately will be going down to Parkway with that Tommy gun. Parkway absolutely beasting it today. Real Potato making his way through the building. Alpha and Bravo under TWP control. Charlie... Still under RU control at the moment, but TWP are definitely on the offensive here. They're coming in, they're coming in straight hard as well. The flares are going out in an ideal position. They're just going to be looking to keep down that pain. Looking towards Lou at the moment, who takes down Antoa. That Tommy gun, looking to find another kill here. Takes down Iron Pro as well. They're going to move through into the building now and maybe take the staircase. We shall see what he's going to be able to do here. Manages to jump up. Finds another team member here. Comes in with a lovely hip spray. Taking down Cosmos. Lou coming in. Picking up Mizuchi. Getting straight back into it. BLR up the top end here. We've got Nurkis on top of the building. With that bar rifle with the AA sides. Looking to pick up a kill or two. Let's see what he's able to do here. He's currently down to a little bit of HP. Goes to that flare. Takes down the flare. Well played indeed. That will stop any sort of spotting. Coming in from the enemy team. Putting down some fire there with the bar. Not able to pick up a kill however. But dealing damage nonetheless. Charlie Point will now start to be reclaimed by TWP. They're here in full force. I am Cordis is going to be attempting to hold inside the building with the Tommy Gun. He does find one member. Take down Lou straight off the bat. Runs into two more members. Kills off Mizuchi. But unfortunately will be going down to Watkins. Who in turn will come in for those revives for his teammates. Looking now over towards the RU guys who would be on Bravo technically if you're looking at this building from a uh, Conquest uh, perspective. However, it is just moved over slightly to the left. <clears throat> As we do see now TWP making their way through. Iron Pro is going to be in defense here. Let's have a look at Mizuchi who's currently using a Panzerfaust. He's going to be attempted to get a kill here. Gets one hit off. Not managing to pop that kill, however. Comes with a few rounds with the M1907 Sweeper. Does not manage to get the kill but does the damage to Pro. Pro is going to have to pull back into that smoke without swim. He gets a reload off and looks to move outside the building. So currently taking some fire there. Managing to pop the smoke grenade again just to utilize the fact that smoke keeps him hidden. Real Potato does come in with a cheeky double. Iron Pro taking down Zellini. Looking to come in. Taking down Harm Pie. Taking down another one. Gives a quad feed before going down to Ready Player J. Very, very well played. Sorry, it's a Demis Phobo. It's not really player, Jay. Very well played indeed. Nice quad feed indeed. Simsei coming in with a few rounds there with that Panzerfaust straight into the building. Looking to push up as well. Bravo under their control. TWP along with Charlie. Now, this is a very damn close game indeed. But look at 168 to 166. RU team did bring it back slightly and they're still continuing to do so. Taking a big sniper hit from that right side from who I can believe was Jetson. Who's now coming in with that revolver, trying to get himself a kill. Not managing to pick it up. Taking a few rounds from that left flank. Goes to the reload, the M95. Looking up again. Looks like that flare was in the sky. Unfortunately, getting shot out of the sky. There's still another flare over here. Next to the Alpha objective getting taken down by the RU team. And TWP is still making a big push out around the back here. As they will be coming in and trying to get those kills. Watkins trying to push up. Going in for a few cheeky shots. Unfortunately getting taken down by Kotsuka Persak. Who is using using what I like to say is my favourite gun on console. And that is a streaming conveyor with the three times. Comes in with a pirate round. That does 124 damage. But no kills whatsoever. I believe that was on these guys here on that left flank. TMP. As you currently see that healing all the way back up the full. Going in for the revive on the teammate. And pushing up towards Alpha. Are they going to be able to do this though? Looks like there's no contestion. I know Persak is starting to return, but that's one man versus many. Starting to take some crossfire. Is Demos Phobos going to be able to hold this? Let's have a look. Okay, so Napro not even knowing where Demos is at the moment. Moving into the Alpha building. Persak is coming around the outside. Is he going to spray through the door? The door has been opened. He knows he's in there. Coming in with a few collateral hits. And he's getting mid-reload. Unfortunately, getting taken down by Demos Phobos. And by the looks of it, nice hold there by TWP. They're able to take back hold of Alpha and keep on the objective.
Bravo point out the moment going all the way back to the RU team. TWP has lost the objective. Grilled Potato is making his way over towards Cosmos. Now Cosmos is coming in from behind him and takes him down from behind him. I'm wondering why he didn't stab him, to be honest. Coming in with the health there for his team and mate. And looking to carry on. And we almost did just see a triple cap coming in for the RU team. But TWP still holding the alpha objective like proper kings. We've got ready player J and Watkins coming in trying to take down Naprom here. He's on, his out on the outside on his own. As he jumps out to try and take down Watkins. And he gets jumped on by ready player J. But we've got him coming from behind. And Nurk is with the, the, the SGG44. And the three times going to be looking to put down some pain. Comes in with a few rounds. Almost picks up the kill. Don't to get it. Goes for the reload again. And he takes a Panda Faust to the face. And goes down via Machuchi. But here we go. We've got RU coming in in full swing. They're coming in in a big aggressive push. Ready player will be going down. Long Harm Pie It's just down to Mizuchi. Who unfortunately be going down to Shadow Death. Keeping Alpha under their team's control. But by doing so, they have unfortunately overextended off of Bravo. They've lost a last remaining team member there. He's just pro on his own now. Somehow managing to get back in just in the nick of time with that Swarmy. Unfortunately, a mid-reload will be going down to Grilled Potato. So, Bravo will be fully under TWP control. Those flares are up into the sky at the moment. And looks like that was RU shooting them down. As they now look to move over into that Bravo objective. With Spectre getting killed off there from Uni's healing. Uni's healing goes up the top there with that sniper rifle. Gets a kill on Shadow Death from behind with a ZK383. So he's picked his gun off someone's body using the sniper class. So he's banding his rifle for a, a lot better close quarters weapon. Big RU push coming in, taking out Watkins and Harm Pie. That was Rust and Lisa. Cosmos looking to go upside the building. We have got Mizuchi on the opposite end here. Just trying to look for any members of RU pushing straight through. And here we go. We're going to have a big clash here on the Bravo objective. We've got Watkins coming in with a few shots. Will be getting dropped there. TWP moving straight in and getting killed off one by one. Partway getting a kill on a BLR. Let's keep it on Partway. He's going in for that revive. Picking the teammate back up. Looking to move through. Comes in with another kill versus Russ. Gets himself a triple as he finished off a member just before coming in for those revives and coming in with a chain revive before getting killed off from behind to Commandant. Well done, Parkway. Absolute beast of a player. So, RU is now on the offensive here. You could see it's still TW guys. We've got a war actually utilizing the FG42 coming in with a cheeky kill against Rust. Coming in with a pistol trying to get another kill. Moves straight in but gets killed off instantly by Cosmos before getting killed off himself by Demos Phobos. So, bravo point at the moment. TWP all over this objective and still keeping hold of it. However, Alpha and Charlie is under RU control. The lead is slowly coming back down as we've just seen Audrey getting dropped there along with Naprom. And looks like we've got Shadow Death going up against Mary Chain and another. Run straight into Mary Chain. Mary Chain with a mid slide taking him down. And Lou coming in from behind for the assist as well. So Alpha will be fully claimed by TWP. However, Bravo has been taken back by RU team. Simsei coming in with a few rounds there, but unfortunately getting taken down by Russ as Russ making his way up but towards the back end. And we do see a lot of members of our U team. We've got Camp Killer coming in for the assist. Is Camp Killer going to come in with a cheeky kill or not? So he's got the M1907 sweeper trying to get that kill. Coming in with a few more rounds of hip fire, not managing to pick it up onto Russ. Russ comes in and finishes them off. Okay, so Russ coming out from the outskirts, going straight back towards Alpha, pops a smoke grenade out, utilizing a grease gun, looking around for any members that he can kill off here. Let's jump aside up to the window. Not managing to do so. Still looking to make his way over towards Alpha. Alpha is still a free bird to be taken. There are no members trying to contain it. However, as he tries to make the move, he has been spotted by members of TWP and gets taken down. Him and Commandant both going out for the count there. Well done for TWP for the quick response into watching those lanes. And keep an eye on any members pushing through. Jetson coming in for a few shots there with that iron sight. Unfortunately getting taken down instantly by Atoa. Atoa getting killed off by Parkway in return. Comes in for the revive picking up his friendly sniper. With Alpha and Bravo under TWP control. They're going to be looking to keep hold of this lead. But again it can switch over at any time. 
Okay, so Parkway on his way back into this Bravo building. Not Bravo building. Back into this building. He's going in for the double revive. Managed to get the hold of the first re revive. Real Potato getting picked up as well. Great teamwork play there from Parkway. Very well done indeed. And I am not entirely sure what he's doing there. A <laughs> little, bit, little bit confused there. Looks like he lost just Camp Killer um, by the looks of things. I have no idea how he died. He apparently went down to Oha, who came in from Alpha, actually. So he's still in there at the moment with the M2 Carbine. Looking to push up and try and find any more rounds to put through into TWP. Is he going to be able to do this, though? So moves backwards and forward on the Alpha objective, utilizing the top of that coal shed. And looks like Grilled Potato just jumped past that door. And Nota still there. We just got a spawn in from Commandant. Oh, and unfortunately there for Parkway. Jumps off managing to get himself a double kill. Just the nick of time. Going in, trying to get himself a triple. And by the looks, he goes for the revive first before turning around to try and get any more kills. Okay, so Alpha, Bravo still on a TWP control. They've got themselves a nice little lead there of six tickets. Keeping RU out of bay of the Alpha point, keeping them kept into Charlie. And you currently see you need healing there in the center of the uh, the whole map with the sniper rifle. Actually, he's not using a sniper rifle. That is an M1907 sweeper if I've ever seen one. But utilizing the sniper class nonetheless, coming with a few shots, taking down I Am Pro. Here comes Spectre for the assist. He enters the building. Finds his teammate, looks around for him. I'd seen that shadow on his right. I'm not sure if he did. Does get the revive just in the nick of time. Starting to get shot in from behind. Loses Iron Pro again. And he gets dropped from the top side too. I believe that was a real potato. It was indeed. Very well played indeed for the TWP guys. Alpha Bravo under their control. RU team doing as much as they can. And still doing a very good job indeed. They're managing to keep TWP on their toes. They're looking at 103 tickets, 121 in lead at the moment to TWP. But our U team is still doing well. They've got hold of Charlie. They're going to be now looking to branch out even towards Bravo. Well, TWP makes too much of a move here towards Charlie, they'll start to spawn off of Alpha. Okay, so Jetson... Looking to move up the top here with that sniper rifle of his. Let's see if he's able to get himself a kill. Gives a lovely kill onto Iron Pro with the iron sighted M95 Gewehr. And he is now looking for another kill here. He's going to be able to pick another one up. Let's see. So he's watching around at the moment. I believe he won't be able to see anyone at this time. Oh, comes in with a few rounds against BLR. But I believe BLR just dropped back to the outskirts of that building. And uh, he did, but unfortunately going down on Watkins. A return of Big Flare going up over the RU guys of Audrey going in for the revive. Getting his teammate back up, utilizing that grease gun. Let's see if he's able to get a few kills here. Get up, soldier. So going in for the grenade there. He's about to be pushed on that left flank. He needs to be super damn careful. Going in for the revives, picking his teammates back up. And taking some fire from that left side, like I said. And unfortunately getting blown over the top of that fence in. Along with his teammate of Cosmos. Very, very unfortunate indeed. Okay, so currently looking at Watkins. I just moved my mouse there for a split second. I apologize. Moving it back up to the top left. And you currently see Anto at the moment. Taking a bit of fire there from Watkins. But TWP on the full offensive. Looks like they did push up a little bit too much as RU team now is starting to spawn off of the Alpha Point at the original home spawn for Germany. In Squad Conquest. Looks like Grill Potato is on his own now on the Alpha Point. He needs his teammates to back him up or even anchor for his squad. His squad of Parkway is down. Looks like he will be respawned on him any second now. An incoming member of Netriz takes him down. We've got Audrey coming up as well. Grill Potato with a double kill. Is he going to come in with a triple? Let's see what he's able to do here. He's looking for that member. He has found him. Gives himself a triple. BLR goes down. Sawomi in hand. Takes up far from that left flank. Explosives going off. Coming down. Jumping in. And getting killed by KDV with a trench rifle. Who will now come in for the revives onto his teammates. Alpha point. God. Alpha point still under RU control. Bravo on a TWP. Looks like we got Jetson making his way over towards that Bravo site. Actually taking a few bits of hit as well. He's rocking that iron side and that model 95. And unfortunately getting killed off there. As soon as I look at him by BLR with the Sawomi. Flares going up and literally getting destroyed instantly straight off the bat. I don't know why the mouse got reset then. And looks like TWP are trying to take back hold of Bravo, but RU team still putting down that mass pressure. But they are getting dropped left, right, and center. Iron Pro coming in with a lovely kill there, trying to get himself a double, but going down to Uni Healing. Bravo is now being taken back 
by TWP. I am caught in the building there. Coming in with a kill against Camp Killer. Goes in for the revive. And he is now about to go down to God of War. As God of War comes in, kills off one, stabs the other. As Bravo is fully under TWP control. Some handsome hands with the FG42. Getting a lovely headshot kill onto Spectre. Goes in a prone to try and save his health. Looks like BLR currently just went down there as well. Coming down along with Persic. Getting a kill on the Parkway and Zellini. And as it looks like Alpha is still being held by the RU team. But again, TWP with a double cap. They have got the big lead here in form of tickets. They've almost got double the amount of tickets to RU. So here comes Handsome Hands out from the top end. Looking to go against Shadow Death. Shadow Death. Not even... I don't know what happened there. But Handsome Hands did not have a clue where Shadow Death was. As Shadow Death just takes him out from behind. But his teammate did come up for the revives. Now, I believe TWP has moved up a bit too much. They have overextended, allowing the RU team to spawn at the rear. Taking hold of Charlie, now putting them under pressure as they start to move out. Clearing off the back end of any forces from TWP as they look to move into Bravo. Shadow Death coming up against Camp Killer. And Camp Killer takes him down with the help of Mary Chain with a lovely pinching fire. Looks like we will now see Camp Killer opt in for a grenade in that building. Start to take some fire from that right side. Finds enemy team members there. Making their way over, which is Persic, Audrey, and KDV. Watkins kills off KDV. We just seen Audrey go down along with Persic as Lou comes in with that cheeky kill. Going over towards Bravo. Still under RU team control at the moment. Alpha and Charlie under TWP. TWP with a full lovely, lovely double cap as they're still getting rid of those tickets. They're now over half the way through to stop in RU from coming in with a clutch back and getting that win. So looking now over towards God of War, who just went down to Demos, uh, sorry, to Atora, who is now taking hold of cover. Commandant on his way up towards the Alpha point as well. Alpha still under RU control. Bravo going back to TWP with no son of RU. Push at the moment. Evil Spectre is on his own at this time. Does get the spawn off of BLR, who will be coming up against Jay. And Jay takes him down straight away. So that spawn was short-lived indeed. And by the looks of it, Parkway did just take down Shadow Spectre. So I believe... TWP are now going to start making their branch up towards Alpha, but by doing so, they're going to start losing Charlie. I can call this out right this second here. So, you can currently see God of War going up against Shadow Death, taking one down. Let's keep it on that left flank of Charlie as well. Spectre still holding true with BLR and Pro. Shadow Death goes down. Alyssa gets picked back up. Nick Rez is going to be moving in with that lovely, lovely MP40. Something you don't see every day. Okay, so making that move over towards the Bravo bit, a Bravo site now for our U team. They're trying to come back with a clutch play, but I believe TWP still has a pretty good presence here. And they're pretty much everywhere. You've got guys coming in from that left flank towards the spawn. You've even got a spawn beacon inside this shed here being very cheeky and sneaky. As Bravo still remains under TWP control at the moment. And will still be that way by the looks of it for the remainder of this game. BLR doing the right thing here. He's currently just sitting as an anchor point, letting his team spawn in on him before getting killed off there by Watkins and unfortunately losing Nurkris as well. As Mizuchi takes down BLR and Nurkris gets killed off by Watkins. Okay, so the rear push has occurred. We've got Cord and Pro actually coming in from the rear spawn, taking hold of Charlie. TWP coming in straight away to reclaim that objective. And Cord unfortunately getting dropped by a grilled potato with that map. I believe that's a map. Swear me, sorry. And still, RU team all over that Bravo objective from the rear and the front. They're coming in for a quick, cheeky pinch. Uni's healing spawn beacon here just behind a bush. But it looks like no one's actually noticed it's there. It looks like Simsei is jumping around the building at the moment, along with Jetson. Incoming RU members of BLR and Spectre trying to get themselves a kill. Unfortunately, down and down Spectre now with healing straight from behind, taking him down a point blank range with an FG42 Alpha still being held by RU team but very well played to TWP look all those flares up into the sky at the moment they're going to get shot down any second now another one just went up there from DWP all of them going down instantly off the bat BLR getting killed off there by the God of War Bravo still under TWP control Alpha and Charlie are, however, going all the way to RU team control. But we all see Mary Chain and Zanini making their way back in with Lou here. Lou going up against Nalpal. 
and comes in with a lovely kill there, taking down Napro and now looking to push over. Make sure there's no other members spawning off them as Charlie's about to get captured back by TWP. Mary Chain with a lovely kill there. Audrey taking down Camp Killer. Audrey actually going in for KDV. Unfortunately, will get taken down at range by Zellini with the M1907 sweeper. Bravo looks very, very, very much in the control of TWP. I am caught. Came in with a lovely double kill. Goes for the revive on his teammate. Simse is still in that building. Let's see if RU team is able to take back all that Bravo object before the end of the game. Coming in with the smoke being deployed. Loses teammate, unfortunately. And I believe there's still one member of RU team there inside that smoke. Oh, there is. And indeed, they both went down. But we have got BLR trying to make a push here. Going up against Phobos. Going down from behind to Simse. May Chain going up against Audrey. You start to take some crossfire from Napro. As Napro is coming in with a Lewis gun, I believe, actually. No, it's an FG42. With just 14 tickets remaining, 293. However, TWP only holds one of the objectives. That 14 ticket lead will be at a standstill until Charlie gets reclaimed from TWP. And if they do manage to take that back, I will start to read out the leaderboards, looking over towards some handsome hands who just went down to Ala Elisa. Comes with the rebuy, picking up the teammate. Very well done indeed. Going up for pro, utilizing that speed boost from Mark and the teammate as a field medic. Very good indeed. Now, Bravo and Charlie is fully claimed. Yeah, we're going to keep an eye on Elisa while we read out those leaderboards and see who has come out on top today. 33 and 9 to Uni's Healing as a sniper class. 39 and 10 to Grill Potato Parkway. 28 and 20, 28 and 11 to God of War. Handsome Hands with a 27 and 15. Mary Chamber the 43 and 12. GG's all those guys. Very, very big kills. I'm going to say to Mizuchi as well. 33 and 10. Very well done indeed. Going over towards the RU side. Iron Pro with a 37 and 21. Very well done. Spectre 36, 27, 27, 16 to Commandant. Shadow Death the 22, 18, 24, 27 to BLR. Alyssa with a 16 to 19. And Napro 25, 24. One ticket remaining, which has just gone down. Very nice games indeed. GG's to the guys of TWP coming in with a big, big win. GG's in the chat. Oh, I don't know why I even type that. There you go, GG's guys. Well played indeed. And I believe as it comes to an end there. So without further ado, guys, I am going to be coming off. I'm going to be sorting out this PC because the audio issue was a bit of a pain in the backside. But without further ado, guys, thank you for joining me. I appreciate it very much. And I will be back again later tonight for NA Xbox game. All versus no sympathy. Please come back and join me for that. And without further ado, guys, I'm out of here. Peace.